proof the right wing is more susceptible to fake news. Here on the Daily Mail it says, oh, Maxine Waters reignites calls to impeach Trump and accuses him of conspiring conspire with the Kremlin and oligarchs of Russia despite the Mueller report exonerating him. Now right there, that's what I call a fake news headline. And the people who have the most to scream about have the most to hide about. And so when you hear Donald Trump crying, fake news, fake news, okay, if he was so innocent, then why shout fake news, deep state, call them all these names and all that, like a mafia boss? Well, you've got something to hide. And here the fake news DM says the Mueller report exonerated him. But they and their right, right wing Trump apologists are, as usual, full of shit. Because the report was not even released. And in the own summary on the obstruction of justice part, even Barr says that the special counsel states that while this report does not conclude that the president committed a crime, it also does not exonerate him. So he hasn't been exonerated. But here they say, oh, he's exonerated. The right wing continues to be really, really, really gullible. Oh, no cons con collusion, no conspiracy, oh, yeah. As usual, they are really ignorant about history. Nixon was not bought up for conspiracy against the United States and its electoral process. Nixon was bought up on impeachment charges for obstruction of justice. And his closest counterpart, Donald John Trump, is going to be bought up on charges of obstruction of justice with his attempts to thwart the Russian investigation in the next part in this is the House subpoena for Donald John Trump's tax returns which is going to shine light on his finances and relationships with Russian oligarchs and they're going to issue a House subpoena for Robert Mueller to tell the American people what was in his report. Release the full report. The best in the plot spin has just begun. The best is going to be saved for last if you really understand and know what is happening, which is what the global right wing don't know a damn thing about.